in recent news, we've seen a lot of stuff going on in Syria where there's been uh, attacks versus the, the rebel forces and the government that's there and, and the use of chemical weapons on the, the populace there. Uh, thankfully, uh, we as Americans haven't had to experience that yet, but that, that fear exists and to get ahead of that, uh, that's why we're doing this training. Guardian Centers here is able to provide us with a realistic environment. This allows us to kind of push the limits of our, uh, our gear, uh, to really use it to, to test the, the capabilities and to validate that it actually works. Here they have a, a cityscape, uh, which we use as kind of an urban environment for us to be able to practice doing sensitive site exploitation and then utilizing the detection equipment. Uh, here they provide nearly live sources. I mean, they take you almost right to the actual chemical agent, and it stops short of putting us in harm's way. But that allows us to validate our tactics, techniques, and procedures, and, and our SOPs, and how we would actually respond to a, a live CBRN response. We are down at the, at the lowest levels of the infantry battalions, training those infantry marines and, and all those other MOSs that support the, the, the fight. Uh, to be able to survive in a CBRN environment. We practice what we do in hopes of that never happening.